just before 820 on our Wednesday morning. If you're looking to get your start in the workforce or considering a career change, stop by Pasadena's Love Local Job Fair happening this afternoon, featuring dozens of employers and career experts. Joining us live in Studio A this morning to tell us more about the fair, we have Julianne with the City of Pasadena and Carrie with the Pasadena Chamber, Chamber of Commerce. Excuse me. Good morning to you both. Thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, you know, this is a really big deal for a lot of folks looking to, to either get a job or make that, that, that change. Carrie, I want to start with you. What prompted the Pasadena Chamber of Commerce to start this job fair two years ago? Yeah, the whole idea for the job fair um, started back in 2021. So post COVID, coming out of COVID, a lot of companies were all of a sudden needing to hire people. Mm -hmm. Everybody was rehiring. There was hundreds, if not thousands of jobs all of a sudden available. And the businesses in the Pasadena um, community came to the chamber and said, we need help. Our biggest issue right now is workforce. We need candidates. We can't find them fast enough and yeah. we can't hire them fast enough. So at the chamber, we said, okay, we're gonna do something about it. So we created an environment or um, a job fair where we could bring um, businesses and candidates together and it's free for everyone. Um, so that was our answer to their issue. Talk to us, Julianne, about the opportunities that exist at this job fair. I feel as if a lot of people associate sometimes job fairs to uh, entry level jobs. That's not the case, though. There are job. There are all sorts of different job levels. Absolutely, um, this job fair is pretty unique in that way in terms of it not being targeted just to one industry nice. um, or one level of your involvement in the yeah, workforce so yeah. far. Um, there's gonna be everything from um, entry, we specifically have a time for high school students actually oh, at wow. the beginning of the yeah. job fair from three to 4.30 and then 4.30 on to six um, is for everyone. But that time is dedicated to high school students. Being to intentional to get them involved yes, in their community. Yes, yeah. make it not so intimidating, yeah. right. not so. It is an intimidating um, yeah. process, even yes. for veterans, right? Yes. Who, who have for to do this, for all of us who, yeah, who, are, who have gone through this process before. Yeah. Yeah. How, how do we deem this to be a success within mm. the community? Well, we measure our success two different ways. Um, the first way would be year over year, we wanna see more involvement. Mm -hmm. um, so obviously more businesses signing up for the fair um, and then more candidates coming. And this year, actually, I would say we've got about a 70% increase in businesses showing up. There's about 96 businesses that have registered as of this morning. Oh, wow. Um, and I think over 600 uh, candidates. And then, of course, we're going to have extras just show up. So year over year increase. Um, and then probably the most important way we measure our success is if even one person walks out the door with today a job. with a job. That's so cool. Even yeah. one person. I know that's not a big number, but just seeing one person yeah. with excitement, a smile, maybe tears in their eyes yeah. saying, I got a job today, then we've done our part. And it's a really sensitive subject too. You know, we started this show at the top of the hour with a conversation on Uplift Harris, mm -hmm. some 2,000 people who depend on this money and, and knowing that there are opportunities like this, job fairs taking place around the greater Houston area, really uh, resonating with people and companies, companies looking to recruit. So right. to see that uh, a success is, is really huge. Julianne, talk to us about uh, the Pasadena Loves Local program. What is it? Yeah, so the Pasadena Loves Local program is a collaborative initiative between the City of Pasadena, the Pasadena Economic Development Corporation, um, and the Pasadena Chamber of Commerce. And it's basically to raise a level of consciousness around shopping local, um, investing money back into your community, uh, working here, living here, mm -hmm. playing in Pasadena, um, and also providing resources to local businesses, um, whether it be through financial assistance, mm -hmm. educational opportunities, um, job fair, finding yeah. candidates, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and the like. So that's that's kind of what that program yeah. serves. And knowing these resources exist all in an effort to get people into the workforce right. uh, means a lot. I know you talked about the dozens and dozens and dozens of businesses participating. Talk to us about the industries. What, what are the different types of industries showing up looking to recruit today? Yeah, one of the special things about this job fair is that it's open to all industries. Um, as Juliana mentioned earlier, we didn't want to we didn't want to segregate yeah. it. Um, Pasadena and the surrounding communities have a lot of different industry mm -hmm. in them. So this is open to engineering, 
um, oil and gas, mm -hmm. chemical, we've got health care, we've got um, the Pasadena Police Force coming out, we've got uh, oh, military, yeah, health care, you name it. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's really yeah. awesome. Yeah. Something for everyone. Something for everyone. Yeah. Well, we appreciate you both, Carrie and Julianne, stopping by this morning to have this conversation. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Absolutely.